I see. <laughs> At the beach. At the beach. So pretty out here. <laughs> So we finally made it. We're here. Uh, tent campsite 185. Look at these trees. Wow. These are amazing. I bet the car all the way in uh, just to kind of get an idea. Trying to figure out where I can put my tent. There's a clearing right here. I'm wondering, I feel like I can put my tent right in here. Or does this go back into this campsite over there? I feel like that kind of is a blocking point. So the road is over there. I feel like this goes into somebody else's campsite. I feel like this little stick here is a barrier. Like this is like, this is your, yeah. So I think you get like all this back here. So I'm gonna actually look into seeing how Okay, here you will put your tent over here. So this is their campsite. This is ours. This is cool. This is really neat. The trees are low. There's an opening here so I can put the middle of the tent right here and have it facing out that way. Because that's the most flat surface for me. That's a dip. bringing the food out in the pouring down rain. It was just easier for us to sit down and eat in the car. But I think it's looking pretty good. Sucks as mold up there. I don't even, I haven't used this so I, mean, I haven't even used this before. So how is there mold? And when we did use it it was dry. Somehow this got wet. Somehow this got wet. So that sucks. Anybody knows how to get rid of mold and see that doesn't work. There's a puddle of water right there. 
I gotta figure something out. Maybe I'll look at some YouTube videos. Oh, there's a puddle of water in our chairs. Huh. This still kind of got a little wet. Our chairs got wet. For real. The mat is definitely wet. You can hear that. We'll have to figure out a better situation. But here's the tent. Tent's dry. That's the, <laughs> the most important part. The tent's dry. Here's my son. Pretty simple setup. Nothing fancy. Just the basics to this time. mistake and I left the windows open and then on this side because the wind was blowing in the rain this side got wet so the mat I had here would end up being wet the corner of the blanket like it's damp this is damp and this is a little damp not big deal but this whole area really was wet this is all dry it was just like a puddle right here so, rookie mistake. All the windows are closed now. Um, camping in the rain <laughs> is. Um, I think this is the first time we camped in the rain to tea or something like that. So, it's a learning experience. This light works really well. I talked about it in my videos. I don't feel like we need to have the fan on, but I do have it propped up here. But something I realized that I would like is something kind of hang like a coat or a jacket on when it's wet. So I don't know if Bell Tent make them the clamps that go on here. So that way I can hang a jacket if it's really wet. But yeah, that's it. I don't know if it's dark. But we're going to go to bed. Trip is watching a little Matt and Rudy. And we're going to call it a night. Bye. Show this. I just put like a little canopy hook. Um, that's to keep from. I mean, somebody really wanted to come in here to can, but this keeps you know drunk people from being able to come and just open your tent easily at night and what have you. Um, or wandering eyes. Um, and then I have a weapon that I just sleep right beside me. Here. So, just a little tip for. Um, solo women campers right there We survived the night. <laughs> it was crazy. My sister's tent uh, was flooded. Oh, sh she didn't put this on first before putting the tent on, so the rain came in the tent. So they ended up leaving <laughs> and got a hotel. Um, I think I told you last night, left when the windows open, so water got inside that side. So I'm hanging that up now. We got breakfast going, which you guys probably already saw earlier. Trip kind of ate there. Um, but yeah, we survived. We survived. This is our little campsite right here. Um, this is 185. It's a really nice size campsite because everything, they have this huge area in the back here. I don't know if it's a part of the campsite, but we're using it as part of ours because our tents wouldn't fit up there. But you could probably see a little bit of my car right there and the picnic table and the fire ring is up there. 
and then these are some other campsites back there but let me get back to cooking <laughs> 